Oh gosh, the things I do for this job, guys. This is literally <laughs> insane. But yes, we're inside the mill of madness right now. And the second I walked in here, I instantly got the chills. I mean, the vibe is set for you to get spooked out of your mind. And it's a new attraction this Halloween. So here to talk about it a little bit more is the owner of this attraction. This is Ryan, and he actually brought his son here. Remind me of your son's name? Oliver. Oliver, he is a brave soul, guys. I've never seen a kid this brave for something this scary. But Ryan, what's really cool about this is that you guys are local filmmakers. Uh, you specifically do horror. Yep. So tell me, what was the goal with Mill of Madness this year? Well, we're in the genre. We love the genre. We're horror fans. It's family owned. And we decided we wanted to just scare people in real life. It's fun to do it on TV, but better to do it on uh, uh, in the live live yeah, setting. So. Absolutely. So take a look, guys. Uh, Rake is a brave soul. He's going to give you a little sneak peek of what maybe you can expect. Obviously, they've accommodated us for this live segment. But uh, you were telling me that you wanted to be different from all the haunted attractions in Arizona. So kind of tell me how you guys are doing that. Okay, so the, generally the haunted house, you go in, you enjoy it, they're fabulous, you, you, you walk just through. With us, we wanted to add the theatrical element. As filmmakers, we have a lot more actors that are playing parts in small scenes. We have special effects shows that last a certain amount of time. The best comparison is if when you go to Disneyland and Universal Studios, you kind of have that actor guide who interacts with you and, and brings you to be a part of the story. That's what we want to incorporate here in the Mill of Madness. Okay, and then real quick, give us context as to how long this took you guys to set up. <laughs> Uh, well, we were planning on doing it last year, and with pandemic and stuff, it just didn't just didn't work out. So we've been planning for, I guess, two years technically, and it worked out this year. So here we are. Okay. So what are you recommending people if they want to come check you guys out? What do they recommend? Well, just come and see us. <laughs> I mean, you're going to come through, and I would say slow down. Don't rush through it. Take in everything. Look at the animatronics. Look at the special effects we've got. Interact with the actors. Have a good time. We're here to have fun. Yeah, for sure. Thank you guys so much. So you can see some of the spooky scenes they have set here. These actors are the real deal, guys. They literally told me, don't get too scared. And, you know, well, I'm trying. But, you know, one thing you should know is that if you want to get tickets, just go to millofmadness.com. If you use a promo code, AZ family, you get a discount on your ticket. And another thing that I want to mention too is that they're Thursday through Sunday right now. They're going to be Thursday through Sunday next week, but then after next week, we'll start doing Wednesday through Sunday. So you can enjoy this guy a little bit longer. But come over here. I want to show you uh, this corridor because, like, this is literally insane. And look at this. Uh, beautiful, well, I don't know if beautiful is the right adjective for this sort of scene, but she has one message for you guys. Welcome to the Mill of Madness. <laughs> so, uh, I don't know. Are you guys scared yet? Because, I mean, I I've been trying to keep it together since coming uh, here. But it's this definitely place is the real yeah, deal. creepy. You know, watching it on TV, but yeah, you're there. You're a little didn't, bit creepy. Didn't hear any screams, so great job, Elena. <laughs> they were being nice to her, I think. They were taking <laughs> yeah, it easy on Elena. Totally. <laughs> Elena, thank you.